face-off guys in the country last year, a transfer from Mount St. Mary, 65% a year ago, and he is donning the blue and gold of Drexel this year. Meanwhile, for UMBC, they'll split duty between Zach Dudley and Colin Steers. Uh, looks like Steers will get the I'm sorry, Alex Steers. Looks like Steers will get the start. 60% last year, came on late in the season, did a good job, 31 of 52. Doesn't get this one, though. The wing picks it up for Drexel on the near side. Liam Kammer and Drexel will have the first possession in the... And Robinson gets him started here. The official time of the goal, let's see, it looks like it's 102. And it's one nothing. UMCO, that's the 15th assist of his career. And we are quickly tied at one. Now on the face, this one won by UMB teams in his career. At the X4, Drexel is 44. Don't see a 44 on the roster, to be honest with you, but I do know Zach Dudley was taking it for UMBC. I'm just going to more consistent at the X which is where we are now. Beals for Drexel and Dudley for UMBC. And here we go now with 102 left to play in the first. And it's a clean win for Beals. Again, 65% last year, second in the country. A transfer from the mound. And so far in this part, Here we go back at the X. It's Dudley and Beals. Beals wins it. Beals makes a beeline towards the goal. And Tinge makes the save on a shot from... He put it on the ground and he put it past Tinge. And now Dudley again. This time with Detrolio. And Detrolio wins it. Detrolio, the transfer from Cabrini. A native of Glen Mills, Pennsylvania. Cabrini D. Thumple's first goal of the day is 58th of his career. But what an impact he's had on this program. 58 goals in 28 games. Dudley working hard, and it's finally picked up here by Trey Fleece. Retrievers had to work hard to get that career game at UMBC. Quite a, a breakout year last year for Mateo Brown. Beals and Dudley. As we descend into the night here at UMBC, another call upcoming. This will be on the Retrievers. It'll be on Dudley more than likely. And the lead now back up to two for the Dragons. Dudley and Beals, the wings come into play. And Drexel wins it again. Drexel won. Right now, Drexel making a case. And they're winning at the X. Dudley and Detrolio. Another flag comes out. Two of them are out. Nobody has possession yet. Now UMBC does, so. For Myers, his first career shot, first career goal in his first career game in a UMBC uniform. 6-4 is the score with 33 seconds left. And the Retrievers will take over on the face-off violation. Are for the Dragons. Dudley scoops it up. Retrievers trying to stack them together here. A couple big possessions. Uh, Doty's got a two-point night. Myers has a two-point night. Two goals, two shots for the freshman out of Mount St. Joe. And another face-off win for UMBC. Dudley all the way. Dudley towards goal. And McGill with the save. A hard right overhand by Zach Dudley. Retrievers have now won the last... since the opening goal by Ethan Robinson at the 102 mark. And that's four straight goals now for UMBC. 
after Drexel had scored four of the previous five. And now UMBC will win on the face. For Dane, nine of 16. Beals and Dudley again. This one will be scooped up by Beals. Back to the keeper. You see what kind of pressure the retrievers come up with here. UMBC out shooting Drexel 31-25 on goal 21-16. Tenge has made nine saves. McGill has made 13 for the Dragons. Beals and Dudley won by Beals. Drexel from left to right to start us off games. And Treganing with the assist. For Brian, that's a two-point night. He's got a goal and an assist. The Retrievers have scored six in a row. They trailed one time 6-3 in the second. They lead it 9-6 in the fourth. For Tomac, it's goal number two. And let's see what Curcio has tonight. Two assists. And more importantly, that breaks a six-goal streak for UMBC. Let's see if we can give them some momentum. They get the face, and all of a sudden now, it's make them take them. 9-7, they got some pep. 38 in 33 games. 75 points career for Mike Doty. Ten seven. UMBC. Battle for the loose ball. It's won by Drexel. Coming out of it is Beals. The faceoff state the score. Dudley and Beals back at the X. Every faceoff crucial. Hooley, 20 goals last year in 14 games. Three goals tonight. Oh. Sliding through, making a big play is Casey Pung to get the ball for UMBC. And the retriever's clear. Big possession. UMBC. With Connor Hooley with two goals here in the fourth quarter, about four minutes apart. Connor Hooley, four goals on six shots tonight. And now Drexel will have possession with just over five minutes to go in a one-goal game. And now the Retrievers trying to take it away. Ball high up in the air. In transition. Haven't heard either one of those names tonight until then. Time of the goal is 11.02 of the fourth. That's three straight goals for Drexel. We are tied at 10. Kenzel gets the goal. Bradley gets our fleece for UMBC, Nolan. One by Dudley. UMBC gets first crack at it. Fleece gets it over to Hall. Tie. At the X, 13 of 25, UMBC has a slight edge. It's Dudley and Beals. Picked up by Beals. And here's a chance for the win for the Dragons. Moving from right to left. And Drexel wants to talk about it. 